welcome back to the channel. Today, well, today it's a windy day, so I'm not going to be doing the move into the bee barns today. I had the bee barns ready to go. I was going to bring them down. I've extended and cleared off the pads. I moved the, the little orange hive back to the back bench. I was ready to go, but the wind keeps gusting to 10, 15 miles an hour, and that will cause problems. You won't be able to hear me, and I'm afraid that if I move the bees into the bee barn out of their normal hives and the girls come out to the these very small landing board and fan that the girls that are out there in the field won't be able to find their pheromone and won't be able to get back into the hives. So that's not something that I'm going to do today. Uh, I am, however, going to go through the Army and the Navy hive. The Navy hive is doing something strange. A lot of bees are on the front of it. I don't know whether they're bearding, whether they're hot, whether there's a bunch of bees coming out for orientation flights, whether they're about to swarm. I don't know. But today we're going to go through Army and Navy and next weekend if there's no wind, and I've been fortunate thus far in this opening that a gust hasn't come by and made it so that you uh, can't hear me. But if it's uh, not windy next weekend, we will move some of the girls into the bee barns. So with all that said, let me get my gear on, get my smoker lit, and we'll get started. I think the first thing I need to do is check the bottom board. I'm going to check the bottom board. This year it's about the bees. Okay. What do we have here? We see that, that there is nectar coming or pollen coming in. Super orange pollen. Hi, girl. I don't see any varroa now. It's early in the season, and I just took the the apivar strips out, so I'm not thinking that I'm going to see any varroa. But it all looks good. It looks like old cappings everywhere. I see some some new cappings. A little bit of uh, a little bit of pollen. That's not pollen sub, that's the real deal. All right, well, this looks good. It looks good, let me clean it off. Now, let's go into the hive. Now, I am not going to go through the flow box on the top. We're just going to set it aside. Come in. Oh, there we go. ton of bees in here. ton of bees. Oh, there's one. Ah, toast. So that makes it a good time for me to introduce you to the Beetle Smasher 3000. Now this tool, this one tool, the Beetle Smasher 3000, will slice them, dice them, smash them, crush them. It fits perfectly inside of a cell and can be found in an ordinary set of Allen wrenches. But there you go. This is the Hive Beetle Smasher 3000. I'm going to be using this today to get into the cells to smash any hive beetles I see. Aha! Uh -huh, they've met their match. This is the War of the Beetles. This is this is this is the year. This is the year I triumph over the beetles. Kaput. Oh there's one right there and bing! get them I'm using the Hive Beetle Smasher 2000. That's the fingers. Okay, the, oh there are there are beetles on this frame. Let's break out the, the Hive Beetle Smasher. Oh we got that one right there. Oh 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 beetles everywhere. Oh more beetles. Oh so far, we're, we're using the Beetle Smasher 2000. Oh, oh, oh. I just wait till they walk up over the frame and then, then they're mine. I own them. Oh. Oh. Oh, another one. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Oh, you're dead. Oh, there's a... You're dead. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, you're dead. There's one right there. You're dead. Oh, there's one. Oh, you're toast. Toast, I say. Another one. Oh, this works beautifully. The Beetle Smasher 3000. Oh, well, the girls are going to have to clean the, the beetle bodies out of these cells, but they're getting the old smasheroni. I'll tell you that. 
Oh, doom, doom. Okay. All right. Oh, oh. Okay, there we go. That's that's a lot of beetles. I bet there's more on the other side. Let's go have a look. Oh, there they are. Look at that. Done. 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 Oh, you're done. You're done. Okay. That was good. There we go. We have some uh, we have some nectar in there. We have brood. We have a lot of brood and drones. Let's see if I see the queen on here. If I see the queen on here, I am going to mark her today. All right, let's see here. Very light frame. Oh, there's the queen. There she is, right there. I'm going to pin her as soon as she walks off of that brood. There she is. There she is. Okay, we've got our queen pinned. Let me get my uh, let me get my marker. Sorry, queen. There we go. I'm sorry. I just want to give you the old marcaroni here. Give you the old marcaroni. There you go, you're marked. Now we're going to put you in a clip. There we go. We'll set you right there. We'll set you right there. So you can dry. I'm going to call that a success. We used the Beetle Smasher 3000 and got rid of 3000 beetles. And we found the queen. We painted her. I am going to go into the bottom box really, really quickly just to make sure. You know what? I will do that now while that queen is in the cage. Just to make sure that we've got some activity going on down there. I don't want the bees to neglect that, that bottom box. All right. Here we go. Stay there for a second. Oh, goodness. Yeah. Oh, we have brood. We have brood down here. So this... This is the part where the bees start to really hate me. I'm going to get rid of that, that old broken open drone brood here. I know, I know, it's the worst ever, I know. Oh, oh, oh no. Future generations of drones, worst ever. All right, well. I've got a bunch of drones in there. I've got a bunch of bees and a lot of captive brood in there. I'm not getting down in there. I'm going to put these girls back on their on their hive, and release the queen, and then get out of here. Because I've angered a lot of bees. Okay. Well, they don't even want me to let the queen out. Okay. Let the queen out. There she goes. And she's, oh, get down in the hive there, lady. Okay, she's back down in the hive. She's back down in the hive. Success! Let's get in the Navy hive now. This Navy hive was acting weird this morning. A lot of bearding going on, a lot of, looks like orientation flights are getting ready to swarm. I don't know, but there were a lot of bees on the front of this box this morning. And actually there's still quite a few. Let them get some smoke. They'll know I'm coming. Let me look at the bottom board really quick. Oh. Oh. A lot of dead bees on the bottom board. I don't know whether somebody was trying to get in there or what. Now the, 
The light's not that good, and I apologize for that. Oh, there's a hive beetle. Oh, you're done. Beetle Smasher 2000 got gotcha. you. Let me flip this around and show you the carnage in the light here. I don't know what all this is. We have a lot of bees. I don't know whether somebody was trying to rob or what. I mean, there's a there's a bee dying right there. I don't know what was going on. Oh, and look here. There's hive beetle larva right up in there. And it's still it's still wiggling. So we're going to give it the old smasheroo right here before I even clean this off. Oh, look at that. We have bees. Bees in the top box here up in the uh, flow hive and they're on every single frame and in between every single frame these girls are bringing in the goods so uh, let's go ahead and remove this box excuse me here we go holy moly you know I may need I may need another box Oh, they've got some building to do here. Mm, okay, they're just building this out just now. Sting me. Oh, look at all that. It's a full frame of drones. Why are they doing that? I better start looking for eggs. All right. I think this hive is getting ready to swarm. That is a lot of drone comb. So I think my plan on this hive is evolving. I think what I'm going to do is go find another box, possibly a deep, and give these girls some more space. This hive is packed with bees. I've not seen a queen cup yet, but I'll bet there's some on the bottom because that was a lot of drones. The queen doesn't do that unless she wants to uh, get some drones flying out there. Okay, this is a full frame of brood. On both sides. Let me look for the queen in the sun. Okay, there you go. There you go. Last one, then we're going to the bottom. Next box down there, girls. I gotta see what's happening here. I do not want not want you guys to swarm but then again if you do you do I mean I'm not going to try to stop my swarms very aggressively this year so let's see a queen oh this is hive beetle jail okay going to the killing board all right sorry that took so long but there must have been 500 beetles on there now they're oh, they're all dead but one hold on a second Oh, 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 you think you're getting away? You're not. Toast. I, these bees are not very happy with me. Because I took off all that drone comb. I'm about to take off some more. Girls, I don't have to do that. I don't have to do that. Okay. Now let's see what we have going on down in here. That whole frame of drone brood that these girls made themselves. Oh, there. Okay, there's some eggs. So I may have a queen in here after all, but I've not seen any. So there's the queen right there. She's right there. I'm going to mark her. Good job, 
piece. Now I'm going to take the queen and cage her. And we're going to set her right in there. Right in there while she dries. Okay. So that, you know what, we're going to set her over here while she dries. I think what this hive needs is another box. And I think I'm going to go get one for it. All right, this was going to be a swarm trap, but now it is going to be a box for these girls. Here you go. Here you go. Watch out. Nobody needs to get the smasheroni on such a magnificent day. I'm getting a new box right mm -hmm. here okay the queen is back in the hive all right Alright, well there you go, the end of another adventure. We did manage to accomplish our goal today. We got through both the Army and the Navy Hive, and both hives are doing exceptionally well. The Army Hive is strong, but the Navy Hive is even stronger, so strong in fact we had to give her a third box. Anyways, we did manage to find the queens, we painted them yellow, and I understand that 2022 is the year for a yellow queen, if in fact your queen was born in 2022, and these obviously were not, but I painted them yellow anyways so that I would be able to find them the next time I did an inspection, so no need to leave a comment. I also introduced you to the Beetle Smasher 3000, a new product that I'm going to be releasing. I'm just kidding, I'm not going to release it, but it works. Screwdriver, jump it down in there and smash those beetles. Killed thousands of them today. And I have come to the conclusion that I am not going to install all of my bee barns all at the same time because it takes quite some time to go through a hive thoroughly and find the queen and marker. And I don't want to get in a situation where I rush and get the queen caught up above the bee barn. So we're not going to do that. But anyways, with all that said, I want to thank you for watching this video if you liked it do me a favor give me a thumbs up if you have something to say by all means please comment if you haven't subscribed to the channel do me a favor take a moment hit the subscribe button ring the bell to be notified of my new content i try to drop a video every friday we try to keep it light and have fun here and i'm rushing through the end of this video because i want to get this done before this giant gust of wind comes in and makes it so that you can't hear me so with all that said be happy and i will see you next week now where's the wind been blowing for 30 minutes I've been trying to do this this closing I haven't been able to get it done because the wind would come in and now there's no wind and I rushed for nothing but anyways I'll see you next week take care